What's up guys, in this short tutorial, I will show you how to fix the connection to server timed out error you are getting while playing Apex Legends. This should be quite an easy tutorial, but if you still have any questions, then leave a comment and let me know. In case you're randomly getting this error, then the issue might not be on your end, but rather related to the server you are playing on. Make sure that the servers are working fine by visiting this page. Everything you need will be listed in the description below. Here you can preview the latest reports about server issues. Below you can use the outage map to better figure out if the error is caused by your own connection. If there is a low amount of reports, then you will have to verify your connection. To test your connection, visit speedtest.net. Make sure that your connection is not fluctuating too much and that your latency doesn't exceed 100 milliseconds. In case your connection is inducing a high ping, then make sure to follow the next tweaks. Make sure to use an Ethernet cable to ensure the best possible connection. If you have to use a Wi-Fi connection, then make sure to restart your router or modem if you haven't done this in a while and reduce the amount of devices connected to the same network. Next, open up your command prompt by searching for CMD and hitting enter. The next two commands are listed in the description below. Ping google.com this command will check your latency and packet loss to Google servers. Use the command ipconfig slash flush DNS. This will flush and reset the content of your DNS resolver cache. Using this command will in any case improve your latency issues and could also fix the connection to server timed out error while playing Apex Legends. You can now exit out of your command prompt and open up your task manager. Here, navigate to your resource monitor as you can see in the video. In a network tab, open the processes with network activity. And after a few seconds, you will see every process using your network connection. This might be your browser running in the background, Steam, or a download bottlenecking your connection. I suggest you to only end the processes which you know won't break your operating system. Below, you can also preview your network utilization in percent. In case none of these tweaks helped you out, then you should try to change the server region and hope that the issue is server-sided. Depending on when you're watching this tutorial, different amounts of users will be playing on the same server, especially after the launch of a new season, server errors are more frequent. I hope this helped you out, leave a comment if you have any questions and see you in the next one.